hello everybody it is now i don't even know where we are on the vlog the house is a little bit of a mess um excuse the dishwasher being on but i am still feeling a little bit under the weather and i have i've been very very keen on banana bread for a few days now so i thought i'd make banana bread now i have got kenzo with me he i think he's quite sad because i was sat downstairs in the office editing youtube videos and then he was up here by himself but anyway um so yeah i'm gonna make banana bread I thought that I'd vlog it because I just find it so so cozy to watch people get on with their day and just doing basic things like that and especially like preparing food and baking like it's just so so cozy so plus it's so it feels so autumnal to do banana bread so I'm gonna do banana bread I think I've said the word banana bread now probably I don't know <laughs> 10 times banana bread First, we're going to put the oven on at 200. Appalachian sunrise meets my skin. Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming. Golden, golden, I'll follow only golden, 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 golden things. Mountain laurel high fives for miles in spring. Rainbow trout and hummingbird. Okay, so the banana bread is in the oven and I am completely naked. Like, I actually just filmed three videos before, um, before having dinner and now I've just done like a little bit of a clean up and yeah, now the banana bread. So I'm gonna take my makeup off and then probably go to bed after an hour. But I'm just really, really happy to have my energy back and feel better. I mean, I was, wasn't even like sick for too long. It was only a few days. I might bring you guys along to the office someday this week, but we'll see. Okay, like I know I said I was gonna see you guys tomorrow again, but how nice do I have it? I mean, look at this, okay, so. I'm sat in front of the TV, I'm going to watch some Netflix and I got banana bread. Can you see that? Look at that. It's banana bread, cup of tea and there's some dark chocolate. So it's like kind of cheating but like kind of healthy but not healthy. I'm going to finish all this and then I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Good morning everybody. Good morning everybody. I'm just gathering my things. I'm gonna pop down by the office today actually. So I thought I'd bring you guys along at least with my phone I think. So yeah, I've popped down my laptop. I'm gonna put down my charger, my lunchbox. I'm gonna go to the bus. So hard to see. goodness can you see that i look horrible but yeah um i just got home from working day i had a really really productive day but it has been so so warm and i think maybe we've had like a slight heat wave because yeah it's like 20 degrees it's gonna be 23 degrees celsius tomorrow so it's gonna be really really warm and that's weird so anyway i am boiling 
Uh, so I'm gonna change from these quite hot clothes and into something a lot more comfier. So I'm gonna do that. Does anyone else just like, the second I get home and just wanna get into my comfy clothes and just be comfy, like walk around the house in comfy, cool, but still warm and cozy clothes. I've always been like that. Always, that's the best. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna change now. See you in a bit. Right, so I am completely knackered. I actually fell asleep on the sofa for just like 20 minutes. And I feel like I always do. So I haven't told you guys yet, but um, like it's not a big deal, but I've started a new job, which basically means I will have colleagues, which is amazing. I'm still back at my old job. I'm just combining them too. Seriously, I have an excuse. My little pug, he's snoring. I know, I know. So yeah, anyway, um, today I got up at 7, so I thought I'd do the same tomorrow actually. So I think I'm going to get up at 7 and just read it on really, really quickly. And then go in, make myself a cup of coffee, go for a nice walk before work. So tomorrow we're actually going to work from here, which is going to be very, very nice. And also which is great because tomorrow's going to be uploading day for me, which is a Thursday. So, um, I mean the office is not too far way it, it is in the city center but it takes around like 20 minutes to get there um commuting so it's definitely not far it's just like you know there's always like you're waiting for the bus that's about five, five ten minutes um so all in all like door to door it might take you like 30 35 minutes depending um and it's just it's just time that i could have better used home at least on the days when I am uploading. So yeah, I think I'm gonna get up by nine tomorrow morning and do that. And then whilst having breakfast, I've actually started to do this some of the mornings if I have energy. Skipped because usually when I do have my breakfast, I watch YouTube, but recently I have just skipped that and had my breakfast. So I was really sad. Had my breakfast down at the office in front of my computer and editing YouTube videos. But it's just that I like getting that extra time. Yeah, I just like working ahead a little bit. So yeah, anyway, that was a little bit of a ramble. I am currently watching some YouTube, some get ready with me for autumn videos. So really, really super cozy, but I'm actually gonna get ready for bed now and go to sleep. And I will catch you guys again tomorrow morning. Okay, so just taking Ken's out for his morning wee. He wants to go that way. But we're supposed to go down this way. Look at that. It's just so typical of him. Look at the eel, come. Come That always works. <laughs> Hello everybody, so I am now at the office, it's actually a co-working space, so there's lots of people here, but we have booked a conference room, you can actually see Lee's reflection there in the <laughs> TV, there's Lee. Hello. And um, yeah, we've had a productive work day, productive, <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, we've had like, hot, we're almost done, and it's a Friday, and I'm so, so excited to for the weekend and just rest do some things yeah just whatever actually I don't have any plans but yeah um, but I just wanted to show you guys just this gorgeous co-working space and well not the space actually because it's like four stories big oh little Fran Lina there <laughs> you can spot two Frenchies oh look at that Oh my god, they're so cute. Anyway, so I am wearing this black knit. I actually decided to keep this one in small. Well, from my previous H&M haul, um, you probably would have seen it. 
I returned the extra small one in the like beige sandy colour. I actually prefer that it is a little bit bigger. I also love these like long sleeves because it, it's cosy, like I can like and I snuggle up. So yeah, anyway. Um this is the space, one of the conference rooms. Look how pretty it is. Like these colours together, it's just playful and then the splash of yellow. So yeah, it's really playful and nice, and it's nice just being here, just like as a change up and not just being at home all the time. So that's quite nice, but I do enjoy working from home a lot as well. But anyway, we have a meeting in about an hour and I'm gonna crack on. I just wanted to pop in because I said to you guys that I'd show you the office and I actually brought my camera. So I thought that I would have some sort of content, but yeah. Anyways, I am gonna, I am gonna, Get back to working now. Big one used to be that size, now it's like XXL. This is a litre, and that's crazy. Herregud. Ska vi ta en mellan? Det skiljer bara fem spänn. Det är klart att det är så här. Skoja med mig. Men jag fattar hur mycket socker är den här. Ja, jag förstår det. Sen ska du dricka en liter själv. Vi kan dela på en liter. This one is too big, and this one is just crazy. Yeah, no, I feel like I'm in America, honestly. One liter. There's actually quite a few people in the salon already, but yeah, we're gonna watch Free Guy, and we haven't been to the movies for like three two years. years. Two years. No, I think it's three years. Two years. Star Wars, I think was the last one. No, it's Lion King. The Lion King. Okay, so 
three, two, three, years. three years. Oh, so we're very excited. And I got the biggest coke in the world. It's too big. It's too big. <laughs> yeah, it's too big. Okay, one see, litre. See you soon. Okay, guys, we're now back home. There's an, a very exciting pug that it's very happy that we're home. Um, I can confirm that I did not finish that one litre coke. It was a challenge and I didn't may finish I, it. Let me preview. This guy is very, very excited well, and well, upset well. that you cannot bring pugs to the movie theatre. Anyways, what did we think about Free Guy? I thought it was quite nice, quite a nice movie. I think I just like anything Ryan Reynolds do nowadays, you know. It's anything just, positive. It's positive, but it's a nice just comedy. Uh, very, very nice. Also, like, just about when the, like, the first 30 seconds of the movie, I got really, really excited and felt like I was at Disney World, which was such a surreal moment because I was like, oh my god! Because we haven't been to the movies for, like, so long, it was so weird. And also, two years since last time. Yeah, but I I remember it like three years ago, which is so weird because that's crazy. Yeah, I oh, know yeah, you. Right. We're gonna get to you because we bought you candy and I've already <laughs> like I've showed yeah, him the, the sticks. Yeah, showed him the sticks already. Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys, but I'm gonna get into my PJs and basically crash on the sofa. I think that's what I'm gonna do. And that guy's gonna get his sticks. Is that right? Yep. <laughs> oh, that's his favorite. See? <gasps> oh, yeah, and, it, and then he always runs away because he's afraid that someone's going to steal it. <laughs> no one wants your candy but you.